So I want you to take a look at my bioactive vivarium and the fedolienses which I have housed in here um, have made a nest. You can see the little hole inside the um, inside the wood which I placed in. Uh, there's a brood. There's a soldier brood that they're carrying. It's quite cool. Um, but yeah, um, I just wanted to show you that. Um, hope everyone's having a Merry Christmas. This was a quite surprise because I um, never saw these Fadoli when I first put them into the vivarium and um, they've completely took it over. Um, this is what the vivarium looks like. It's got a bit of uh, this here which houses different creatures and things. If we're lucky we can maybe see one. But there's a few of them there. Um, but most of them are just micro creatures like springtails and hypoaspis mites which I now rear because I need them. There's an old bit of a super worm beetle which died in the vivarium and turned into um, some nice food. There's some clay balls which I put in which the springtails seem to like to um, nest under as well. So um, it's all pretty good there. There's, a, there's some isopods there as well which seem to like it. So I'm just going to put that back where it was so they don't get disturbed. But yeah, there's isopods there, which they seem to not like to be disturbed, so put that back. Um, the, usually the isopods would usually be under this, which um, they don't seem to be, but plants seem to be growing here, so I need to chop them down a bit, so they don't get across to the actual thing. But yeah, they break down the material here, which I find quite good to watch, but most of it, I, I do cut this vivarium every two weeks and this stuff here that grows gets eaten by the isopods here see and that that's just that and they hide and breed I've seen a few baby isopods and some hypoaspis mites eat some mites that are in the vivarium but yeah other than that it's pretty cool and I like this vivarium very much because it houses the fidoliensis but yeah thanks very much for watching Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year from Ants Scotland. Let's look at the entrance. Um, I never made that entrance, funnily enough. They actually chewed that. So they do actually make wood nests, these Fidoli. So yeah, um, I'll update you all later on on how they're doing in the new year. And I'll see you later.